and today we're gonna to take a nice little walk it's literally beautiful today I'm so obsessed um it's like the first day it's felt like a nice warm kind of like fall weather like something that I'd enjoy and the sun is really shining and it's beautiful so we're gonna take a walk and then we're gonna do this like I've been wanting to like capture campus kind of and there's so many beautiful like little details in all these old buildings and the autumn color like the trees are just popping off popping off so we're gonna go walk around and just kind of maybe do a little joggy jog, kind of, you know, our little hot core walk and we're gonna bring a sketchbook. So I went to the grocery store today and I've been seeing so many artists do like mixed media work. So of course the grocery store is right next to the art supply store, of course. And you know, since I took the time to go all the way to the grocery store, I thought, oh, why not? Let me just uh, pick up a few things from the art store too. So we also stopped at the art store and picked up some new things and I've just been seeing all these artists like I said doing those mixed media work and I just really like I do a lot of painting and I love painting but it's just so cumbersome sometimes and just takes so much energy. So I wanted to just kind of do some quick loose sketching to really capture just kind of the fall colors, how beautiful it is. Um, so I bought this cute little sketchbook and I'm super excited about him. Um, he's very small, so hopefully we'll be able to do like some good quick sketches and just kind of document kind of campus and stuff. And then I see so many artists use these Posca pens. So I bought a little bright blue Posca pen and I'm excited. It's kind of like the, I'm hoping it'll be like the blue of like crisp autumn skies. Like that was kind of what I was going for. They had kind of limited color selection. So I just kind of got what I got and I've never used Posca before, so I'm really excited. And then I bought a little white Posca pen, just kind of maybe in case I make mistakes, I can cover it up. <laughs> but also I think that it'll be really good um, for like some like bigger paintings and stuff and like working on canvas and just like making little detail works. And then I bought um, a Micron pen in sepia, I think, sepia. Uh, and I thought that would be nice because it's like not as stark as black and it kind of has like warmer tones. So I thought that'd be nice for autumn. And then I just am obsessed with these jelly roll pens and I have one in white and like I just love it. I use it all the time. So I also bought one in brown because I thought it would be nice for this because I thought I had lost this Micron pen originally but turns out I did not lose it. I just had stored it in a correct place that it should have been the whole time and just thought oh I would never store it in its right location. So hopefully there'll be some footage to show you guys kind of like what gets done and yeah. All right, little running fit, feel very suburban mom. Let's go.
is Sayari Creations. I ordered actually from her website because I didn't want Etsy to take some of her fees. Um, but I follow her on Instagram and I love their stuff. It is literally always the cutest post and everything is so happy. So I would totally recommend giving them a follow. So, so cute. Five stickers and three of them are for friends and two of them are for myself. So let's take a look at them. I was totally most excited for this one because look how cute he is. Oh my God, yes. So she does a lot of like Pokemon work which I love, love, love. So I bought this actually for my friend. Might keep him for myself, low key. Or maybe just orders, cause she's got like seven or eight, but he's so cute too. This was another one I was super excited about cause like, look, it's holographic. And I was really debating between Espeon and Umbreon. Let's do Umbreon cause he's cooler, cause dark mode Eevee is the best. But this is the one that like really prompted me to place an order because my friend is visiting me this weekend and she's like obsessed with skulls right now I don't know why it's not a Halloween thing this is just like what she likes so I thought she would love this sticker because it's so so cute with the little cats and then the skull is so cute so I bought that for her so hopefully she'll like that this weekend and then I brought this grumpy cat for my other friend who I sit next to in class because she has a cat that kind of looks like this one, and this reminded me of her. Yes, so these are the ones I bought, and I just, oh, they turned out so good. I'm a big fan. I would have ordered a lot more off her site, but I ran out of money, which is fine. And I think this one's definitely my favorite. I am very obsessed with him, but I might put him on an art journal, and this one just saw my Switch case. Would totally recommend her stuff.
so yeah, that's the end of the video. I hope you guys really enjoyed. I had a lot of fun filming this video. I think it was just so nice to like look back and be like, oh yeah, that's how I drew that. Or, oh, that was really cool. Yeah, I enjoyed watching myself make that. Is that conceited? I don't know, I but I enjoyed it. So, and I had a lot of fun editing. I've never done any kind of like video work before. So this was a huge, huge learning curve on editing and me just being like, what are the hotkeys for this and what is that? Um, I hope that you found something maybe inspiring from it or calming or I don't know, like just put in the background, folded your clothes or and just watched it kind of like in passing. That's kind of what the intention was. But I really would love to film more of these. So if you have any ideas, thoughts, things you might want to see, like maybe a little more look into like life or process, like let me know in the comments below because I'd love to have some more ideas on things to film. Um, cause I really enjoy it and honestly my memory is kind of crap nowadays so it would be really cool to record some things in my life and just like kind of remember, um, you know, what I was doing and this year or that month or, you know, oh that was really pretty, I'm glad I filmed that, like life maybe isn't so bad. <laughs> I'd love to get you guys' feedback and I really hope you enjoyed cause I did. Bye! Thanks for watching!